My name's Thomas Heatherwick. I'm a designer and I work with a team of 230 people and we design buildings and we design places with a focus on human-centric experience. I was aware of the impact of sound on environments from quite a young age because my father was a musician. When I was first working on building projects, he was just walking around doing this to hear the reverberation time and see how that felt as a space. I mean, even just in the space that we're in now, we sandblasted the concrete so that we took away the surface cement and then that was broken down to what you see is London uh, shingle from the River Thames and immediately the sound waves that hit that are broken and fragmented because you don't get a singular reflection coming back at you. I think that there's a lot that design can learn from the world of sound. I think that you can have more intensity and power and enjoyment and pleasure in experiencing place and simultaneously make places more sustainable because they are designed to connect with people and have meaning.